What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Here we are back with one of our favorite comedians, Mr. Peter K, the tour that didn't tour tour, talking about school reunions. I'm so excited to dive into this one. I had my first 10 year reunion not too long ago, but I didn't actually make it because I moved out of the state and I moved like 11 hours away. So I was like, I just moved maybe two months prior. So I was not about to make that drive. Uh, yeah, it's just too long. And the flights are too expensive. So I missed it. And I hate that I missed it. 20 years, I'll be there. Uh, but before we dive into this, if you guys happen to enjoy, don't forget to subscribe, give the video a thumbs up, and let's dive right in. I have the occasional Baileys sometimes, more of a dessert than a drink, I grant you. Last time I had a proper Baileys, I went on my school reunion. Have you ever been on one of them? I tell you now, there's a reason you've not kept in touch with some of them people over here. <laughs> But someone got in touch through Facetube, and I thought, I can't, I've got to go. Curiosity got the better of me. And I went with a mate of mine, he said, your worst nightmare, oh, you're no. walking in, there's people I've not seen for 20 years. You know you're getting old, but local lollipop lady in your class at school. <laughs> and everyone's got older and fat and balder, <laughs> them's the women. Yeah. And, it's over. <laughs> and they were all, all teachers with her, they don't get any older. Nuns, I had nuns teaching me. Honest to God, nuns are miserable. No sense of humour, none. <laughs> I'll tell you that now. <laughs> we send him a Valentine's card every year from Jesus, every February. <laughs> Roses are red, violets are blue, sugar is sweet, I died for you. I used to say the nuns of Valentine's Day card from Jesus every year is crazy. Sister Sledge, she went mistress at our school. Sister Sledge, she was lost in music, caught in a trap. <laughs> we'll turn him back. Someone's got all fifth year boys in the assembly hall because someone's thrown a shatterproof ruler at Carol Farrell. It's, were there a time before shatterproof rulers existed? What were they blowing up in kids' faces? Why were they shatterproof? What were that about? Shatterproof. Get them shatterproof, Bob. Shatterproof these, quick as you can. Sh blowing up in kids' faces here. Get them shatterproof, son. Bang! Another one gone here. Get quick. Shatterproof. It hit her there. If it had been an inch lower, it would have been instant death. If it had been an inch lower, it would have been instant dead. Find out who it is. I'll take them on that stage in assembly and I'll bang them in front of everybody. Oh. Dang. I think you will. We had real teachers, though, as well. We had humans. They weren't all nuns. Yeah. Have we got, have we got any um, teachers in tonight, by any chance? Oh, whoa, whoa, don't shout out. Put your hands up. <laughs> Whoa, 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 don't shout out. Put your hands up. Yeah, give them a taste of their medicine, Peter. Okay. One rule for one. Fingers on lips. <laughs> I used to like teachers with amnesia. <laughs> Who do you think you are? <laughs> Who do you think you're dealing with? <laughs> How old are you? Where should you be now? <laughs> do you know who I am? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Silence when you're talking to me. <laughs> I don't want to see you floating around school. <laughs> Who do you think you are? <clears throat> Waltzing in at this time. <laughs> I was any of y'all ever disruptive in school? Like y'all always, teacher always had to get on to you because you were always doing something you wasn't supposed to be doing. Talk to me in the comment section, I'd love to hear it. <laughs> Don't come in here, start mouthing off. <laughs> come in here, start shouting the odds. Seven, nine, eleven, forty-three, twenty-seven. <laughs> Who you think you're swanning in at this time? I just know that's grade five boys. I just know that I know in my heart of hearts that would be grade five boys. I know for sure. Put your pens down and watch the blackboard while I go through it. <laughs> Who's like that one, me? Keep talking, keep talking. Because the longer you talk, the longer you'll stay. I don't care what time I go home. Quarter to nine, we kept him till. Quarter to, oh, quarter to nine. I'm supposed to be going for a meal with my wife. Oh, bollocks to you, you said. Stay, I'm happy, me. 
I'm here for now. I'm taping Taggart. You don't bother me. <laughs> do you ever try and blind the teacher when you watch? Have you all confessed? <laughs> <me? laughs> Have you all did it blind the teacher now? <laughs> do you know? <laughs> now, I know who it is. No, you don't. You can't think <laughs> f all. You don't know who it is. <laughs> try and burn it all in front of his pants. Oh, my God. Fog. His balls are smouldering. His balls are smouldering. Do you know? <laughs> Fire alarm. <laughs> I always wanted to be out me when um, Bell went, my first one out. You start yeah. packing everything away about two yep. minutes before Bell. Yeah. Put everything back uh, in my pencil case, really, mm -hmm. really discreetly. Yeah. <laughs> Teacher tried to say, well, hey, don't, I don't, dis the Bell don't dismiss you. I dismiss you. Teacher, favorite, teacher's favorite line. Bell don't, what you packing up early for? We're not done. That, but you don't leave when that Bell dismiss you. I dismiss you. Oh my God. That's your favorite line. Put it back in my bag. There you go. But still pretend I've got a pen, an imaginary pen, because they can't see because someone sat in front, so you pretend you're writing. <laughs> put, your, put your coat on really discreetly, you know. Yep. That bell's yep. for me. That bell's not for you. That bell's for yep. me. That bell's a signal for me to tell me to tell you when you can go. Do you hear me? Do you hear me? How <laughs> mad they were. Mr. Bryce at our school. What an asshole he was. Saw him oh, on that school reunion. I wanted to wind him. <laughs> right, weirdo. Took us on a geography field trip to graveyard to see his wife. And it's all. He said, took me and took us on a geography field trip to the graveyard to see his wife. What, what do you mean? What? That's crazy. <laughs> he just sat there sobbing. We were playing arm and headstones. I was like, da -ra, da -ra. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, you can't go. Peter K is one of the funniest men that you will ever hear. This, bro, as a comedian, I don't know if it gets better than Peter K. This man can do it all. He will have you laughing for days. He didn't like me. Is that what you're going to be when you grow up, K? Comedian? <laughs> I'll tell you where you're going to end up, K. The thick table. Get your stuff. Get on the thick table. We used to have a thick table in our class at school. A thick table. When I say thick table, I don't mean thick table. Yeah. I mean thick table. <laughs> You'd never get away with that today. PC no. and all that. No. This is 20 years ago, and all this ADHD and dyslexia. Thick table. Get on the thick table. <laughs> Jason Patel. Oh. Snorkel <laughs> Parker sat in bin ass first of all. <laughs> Big table, Jason. Till you oh learned. my god, I'm telling you, yeah, that would not fly today. I had so funny that it was that they had that back then though. Uh yeah, parents would be all over it today. It just wouldn't fly. Trees are crank fist. Oh Jesus Christ. With space dust and snot bubble. <laughs> <laughs> oh Treaser. Paddy McGuinness, thick table. <laughs> Let the thick see the table. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. That's true. I was that with him. He's watched television in class and he's wheeling this massive television on legs. It were up there. Two prefects use wheel it in like prize in a game show. <laughs> Massive, you're like meerkats watching it, like. Yes. What yes. video went lockbox? That'd have been nicked. <laughs> Remote control and a wire. <laughs> Systematic stood on chair with Ariel trying to get a picture. Can you see? Can you fucking see now? Can you fucking see? <laughs> I would never have found the PE at school, me. I could see astonishment in your eyes, but I would never have found. 
I were never a fan of PE at school. I can see the astonishment in your eyes. I don't. I can get a beer. <laughs> never a fan. I don't believe you can be physically educated. They used to make us walk on an upside down gym bench. Did you ever do that? You used to balance walk along. Him weights dropping off me now, sister. <laughs> I used to pretend I forgot my kit. I forgot my PE kit. Get something out of that bin in the corner. Fucking fencing mask and a netball skirt. <laughs> <laughs> Forward roll. <laughs> All changed. The ropes. Get on the ropes. Get on the ropes. Oh, they've been on the ropes twice now, sister. <laughs> Sit on this pissing bench. <laughs> I run pat lunches, me. Pat lunches were two spam oh. sandwiches and a munch bunch yogurt. Oh. And a rock hey. and sugar lunch box. Pack of salt uh. and shake. Island toffee. And a, a beaker. Mum used to give me a beaker with orange cordial with some cling film over the lid so it won't spill in my bag. You don't want that all over your books. You ever back your books? What are that about? Backing books? Come, get me that wood chip wallpaper from the side of wardrobe. <laughs> Put back my books here. Annie Glitter, razzle. Back my books here. <laughs> Keep me safe. Oh, get alive. Man. I used to love it when I went dining hall at school and someone would fall with a dinner. You just get walking back to the seat, you'd get some girl walking. <laughs> they want to go, whoa! When they were sick, they used to put sawdust down. What were all that about? Sawdust? <laughs> There's nothing to see. On your way. Of course there's something to see. She's throwing up sawdust here. She's throwing up sawdust. <laughs> Some carpenter's daughter. Look at that. Shavings. Blew. Shavings. Should be embarrassing, buddy. She's a freak. <laughs> they were doing that at school reunion about half past ten. Everyone were drunk. Sister had doing it. We're going around with a bucket of sawdust, throwing it down. <laughs> I'd had a few Baileys, I were up on karaoke, with trees of crankfish, giving it bump and grind. <laughs> <laughs> trees are off her tits, pole dancing with crucifix. Oh my. Sister Sledge, I'll kill her, I'll fucking kill her. Where's my shatterproof ruler? Last night, I said, Dear Deliver. Bro, I absolutely love getting a chance to react to Peter K. He uh, reenacts being in school so well because you feel like that's exactly how it was being up in that classroom. And that's exactly how you was as a kid. Uh, but that was awesome. That's all we have. If you enjoyed, don't forget to subscribe. Give the video a thumbs up. I'll see you next time.